Hello, 8th grade, and welcome to this week's Weekly Breakdown. I have three announcements for this week. Starting with the first announcement that we are going to have a lab class on Monday, I will make sure to send you an email to keep you updated and reminded with that specific announcement. So please do not forget your lab coat because if you do not get your lab coat, you will not be able to enter the lab class and you will not be able to attend the lab experiment for this week. As for the second announcement that this week you are going to have your post test to look at the progress that you have made starting off with the first semester. So be ready for the post test. I will make sure to announce the date during this week and send you an email. As for the third announcement that this week we are going to have parents meeting conference. I'm very excited to meet your parents so we can talk about the progress that you had since the first semester. And I cannot wait again to meet your parents. Let's start with the second lesson of the fifth topic that we talked about for starting last week, which is natural selection. So we are going to talk about evolution by natural selection. So we said organisms produce more offspring that can survive. But due to the environment around them, they are adapted to new traits each time there is a new change in the environment. Let's talk about this example where birds used to eat green beetles. So they kept on eating green beetles until green beetles were what selected against and brown beetles have flourished. So now, what will the birds do? They will have to change the beetles that they eat from green into brown. This is what natural selection means, that the animals will adapt according to the environment. Factors that can affect the evolution is mutation and migration and genetic drift. So mutation is an accidental change in the DNA that can give rise to variations among individuals. Or immigration is when the movement of individuals run out of a population, so they change. And the genetic drift is in when by chance they leave behind a few more descent and genes, of course, than other individuals. So we have artificial selection is when humans select the variation that are useful to them. Example, a farmer breeds only his best livestock. And we have specification which is the process by which species are generated can have a number in different of ways. So, the evolution that started by natural selection can be e either natural or it can be artificial. So, this is it for this week. Thank you so much, 8th grade. If you need anything, you can ask me and you know where to find me. Thank you so much again, 8th